In today's episode, we have a brand new puzzle from Adventure or ID Venture. It's called Cryptos. It is a really sweet puzzle. It's a flat pack wooden puzzle that you put together on your own, build a puzzle. You've seen their stuff before. Davy Jones's Locker, Schrodinger's Cat. This is the new one, Cryptos. Check it out in today's episode. Welcome to episode 86 of Puzzle Time. Uh, I am Tyler, this is not Tony, this is Linnea, my sister. Hello. This is Linnea's first episode. Tony is now officially moved away from here and no longer shooting episodes with us. So you'll be getting Linnea feasibly full time. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, let's jump in to today's episode. Actually, you know what, Linnea, why don't you introduce yourself a little bit. Uh, how long have you been a Puzzle Master now? Um, well, we've been working in the business part-time our whole lives, basically. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> um, but I've been here full-time for two years now. Two years, yeah. yeah. So, Linnea does a bunch of our she do shipping and stuff, kind of. Social media, for the most part, now. I started out with okay. shipping and uh, peeling puzzles and packing puzzles. And yeah, you know, it's just whatever they need done before. And now it's social media, for the most part. You'll see her on TikTok. She does a lot of the posting on our Facebook page too. So if you're interacting with someone on Facebook or even in the comment section on our YouTube channel, chances are it's Linnea. Uh, so she does a lot of the behind the scenes stuff and then kind of some of the in front camera stuff on Facebook. And like I said, on TikTok, that's actually some pretty big stuff on TikTok lately. Hey? Yeah, we've been getting actually quite a few views. Like I think our most views is 600,000 views so yeah that was on the good luck box yeah yeah so go check that out that's that blue puzzle box you'll see it on our tiktok page um uh go check that out and then also uh what was the other one there was uh the snakes one that oh, was the, the snakes. other i like that snakes one so Linnea does some great videos on tiktok and go check them out there uh thank you guys for watching today we are gonna jump in right away here to our draw now we did a draw on 82 when we kind of have been doing that draw every like four episodes or so for stuff and so we had talked about doing a draw for this puzzle master shirt um i've got a whole bunch of different sizes so whoever wins just you're gonna need to let me know the size and we will send you a uh, puzzle master t-shirt and i promised a mystery puzzle our mystery puzzle is the cannon this is one of our uh metal lines so it's our puzzle master brand Canon right here. I'll show you on the top camera. There it is. It's a level seven. It's a great little sequential discovery metal puzzle. If you have not played with it, man, it's a good one. So you will love it. So we had, Linnea, I think we had 32 comments on our, uh, on the video for oh. on episode 82. Now a bunch of those were us responding to comments. So it looks a little better than it is. I think in actuality, there were 16 people that entered the contest and I picked out one that I liked. Now I picked on, let me just give me a second here to find it on my phone. And thank you guys. The comments are actually getting more interesting as we go. They with are. Draws, so thank you for that. Yeah. And I'd say keep doing more interesting comments. Like we had a joke. We had a few other things. Um, lots of people put great puzzles, things like that. That's good. Be creative because I we want to see creativity and something maybe a little longer where you put some thought into it. So that is actually how I determined who I picked. So I picked Dave S. Now Dave S did a poem. Great looking puzzles, he says. Poem of the day. I'd rather be doing puzzles, but no, I'm guzzling beer. As I lay in the hospital getting better, as I wonder what puzzle is up next, I wish I could just send a text. So thank you, Dave, for your poem. You will be getting a Puzzle Master shirt and this Canon puzzle sent to you. You just got to send us your uh, mailing address. So email us at info at puzzlemaster.ca. That's info, I-N-F-O, at puzzlemaster.ca. And you will claim your shirt 
and your puzzle. Uh, usually we would start another draw and I think I'm just gonna leave it this time. We're gonna, we're gonna hold off on the draws for a little bit and we're gonna just jump into today's puzzles. Um, Linnea, which one do you wanna start with? What do you think? Um, you can start off by... That one, Cryptos? Cryptos? Okay, Cryptos it is. Now, you guys have probably seen ID Venture before. Uh, they do some amazing puzzles. Honestly, I think on it, for what you get for the ID Venture, Adventure puzzles, best price by far. Uh, we have a whole bunch of those. What are there? What, do you remember what the names are of those two? There's the Davy Jones's Locker. Yeah, that's the new one. Schrodinger's Cat. The Schrodinger's Cat. Yeah, no, these are puzzle boxes. These are like those escape rooms in a box. Uh, this one's a little different. Have you played with this at all? Uh, no, I read up a lot about it on online, but I haven't had a chance. Yeah, Linnea did a bit of yet. Linnea did a bit of research. So it's called Cryptos. It's a wooden puzzle kit. Now, oh, there's a little card in that. Mine doesn't have a card. Oh, the card fell down in mine. I see. So thank you very much for choosing Cryptos. Cool. You can consider it a, as a you can consider it as a puzzle and build it without looking at the instructions, or you can visit our website. Oh, and they have assembly instructions. Interesting. So it's kind of set up two ways. And so what this is essentially is a flat pack uh, puzzle that you put together. There was a lot of stuff in here. So we've seen this before. What do you remember? What are some of the other companies that do these? Um, uh, type NKD of puzzle. NKD has some really, really good um, ones. U Gears was another Gears, one. We've yeah. done some U Gears. Uh, there's some other ones too. There's We have quite a few of these that do kind of like a plywood flat pack. Metal, metal Earth does metal. Metal ones. Earth does the metal ones. Yeah, absolutely. So you take take yours out, Linnea. You, you play around with that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show these off a bit here and I'll do a bit more talking about it. So, Cryptos. This will make a six letter cryptex. And what that means is you can, I don't know if you can program on this. Do you think you can? Can you yeah, program? Yeah, you can change the code. Yes, you can. You're right. So up to six letters. So you can do an up to six letter code. Um, and uh, you can program that in. And so it's essentially a puzzle box that you open up with a code. And so I'm not sure how you program the code. You can see, boy, where's all the letters? There we go. You can see the little letters there. There's all the letters on this dial. Um, so yeah, the dial will be on there and you can turn it. Oh, there's a whole bunch, geez. I wonder if it's the way you set it up is how you do your code or if you can set it after. I bet you there's pins inside. I bet you it's a pin thing because you can see some of the holes in here, like these holes maybe, or like where you pin it is where, what letter it lands on. So like they're saying on the card, uh, you can try to put this together on your own without instructions, which I assume there was instructions inside the box on this. There definitely is not. Or you can go to their website and they have a link. Oh, they have, oh look, they have a QR code. Or I think there's a link up here too, to, to their stuff. So you can get the assembly instructions on their page, which we actually looked at those beforehand. I didn't realize that's what that was. I just assumed that there was instructions inside. So there's not, or you can just make this, that'd be insanely hard. Yeah. Can you imagine trying to put this together and not like having instructions on what goes where? You probably mess up in which <laughs> order. That's, that would be the, I guess they're all labeled in that's numbers. That's insane. Yeah, I mean, there's numbers and letters on stuff. Um, Order that's key. crazy so the, and then you have what's the one you have there you have one that looks like a key yeah so this is what locks it into place these three keys here uh, and then so by where the pin by where the pieces sit in here with your code is how it's gonna unlock right it's and that, go through those pieces right that now. releases it this is cool i mean seriously uh, adventure id venture however you say the name is quickly quickly becoming one of my favorite puzzle makers they do some great stuff uh and this one i a little bit of more research this is the wood is birch um so it's it doesn't actually yeah it's still plywood it's a birch plywood so it's got a wood oil on it too you can kind of when you feel the wood it feels a little different too you can kind of feel that they've oiled it which which is good it means that the pieces don't warp or um expand or anything or contract uh, it is 45 pieces. I looked it up. Oh, okay. 45 pieces. So could you imagine? I, I can't imagine putting a 45 piece puzzle together without instructions. I would personally recommend the instructions on their website. But I mean, if you want a really good challenge, um, go ahead and, uh, and, and try it yourself. That sounds crazy to me. But um, so actually, oddly enough, we have two puzzles that are both kind of uh, 
built it up, I would have been, hey. Oh yeah. So that is the Cryptos uh, from Adventure. Go check it out, puzzlemaster.ca. You can get it there. Really good uh, if you like building your own puzzles and it offers a bit more of a challenge if you don't want the instructions. So cool. Let's go on to the next one. This is from Christian P Poliziani. I always have trouble with his name. Christian Poliziani. Love the name. He's Italian uh, and has a company called No Way Puzzles. Now, you've probably seen this before on Puzzle Guy's video. Uh, go to Puzzle Guy's channel on YouTube. He will show you the solution. I watched it. It is phenomenal. This is called the Couplic. Couplic. It's a level eight on the Puzzle Master difficulty rating scale. Now our scale runs from five to 10, five being the easiest, 10 being the hardest. So this will fall right in the middle. And I will pretty much guarantee, Lene, you can try solving it, but I pretty much guarantee we're not gonna be able to solve it. Now, hold on, before you get too far, your box is a little different than mine, hey? It's different colored, yeah. Yeah, yours is like white on the outside with green on the inside. Mine's pink on the outside. Cool thing about these boxes too is they all click together so he doesn't actually use glue to hold his boxes together. Oh really? They actually come apart. Yeah. They're just all. It's really cool. The packaging on this, it, it's got, it's great. It's got like some little holes in the bottom that show you a bit of the, the, the puzzle and the, the stand inside. Mm -hmm. I like how you notice there's that gear stand thing and it like yeah. interlocks into the outside of the box here. You can see that, like see there's the gears on the inside and it interlocks in those slots on the outside. So that's great. Uh, you've probably seen No Way Puzzle before. Uh, you might recognize it, Gearly. Now that Gearly looks kind of like what the, the base is, hey? Have you have you seen that Gearly puzzle? Yeah, the two piece one that you have to, it's kind of a maze to come apart. Yeah, yeah, it's a bit of a maze. Man. There's a lot of papers in here and I am dropping stuff all over. It's okay. gonna be so hard because you have so many cubes and you have to figure out which way, like, this is a ridiculous the puzzle. The cubes all have different sides on them and different colors. And not necessarily every cube has the same color scheme. Right. And I, one other interesting fact actually on this puzzle, I was told that the uh, puzzle itself was hand painted by uh, Christian and his, uh, I believe his girlfriend helped them. Oh, okay. Is what I was told. So they hand painted each side. So after these are cut, they went went and like hand painted each side. Take a look here at the cubes. Um, you can see they're just like, it's wood just cut into cubes. So it's pretty straightforward. And it's, it's kind of rough sounded, like they're not actually super smooth, which I thought was an interesting, interesting dynamic to it. Now, like I said, um, the base is kind of reminiscent of Gearly. And you can see it here. The base has the name Couplet on it. It has the No Way Puzzles logo and name. And then Christian Poli uh, Poliziani has his, his name in the year the puzzle was made. And then there's a great little base and the way it fits in is you can see the uh, it's triangular and then the, the base will fit in like that. And it kind of gives you a base to work off of and lifts, lifts the puzzle up and lets you put the pieces in. You trying to get it there? Yeah, I don't know if I have the right colors or not. Cause... It's it's hard. I watched, like I said, I watched Puzzle Guy's video on this and he he struggled a bit. Now, what he actually ended up doing is he ended up counting the amount of faces of each color. You would have to, to know. Right, because you got to see, you got to make a nine sided color, right? Nine nine squares on each side. So you've got to make got to make sure there's at least nine nine squares of that color. And not even squares because you look, look, there's two yellows on this, but this can only be one yellow side, right? So just because there's you two, have it doesn't to watch which sides are going the corners here. Yeah, the corners was where he really did a lot of, I think for, for Puzzle Guy when I watched him, he did a lot of his like figuring out what went where was those corners because you're like, oh, I have to have yellow in this. So once he had his colors figured out, and he, I don't even think he had all the colors figured out, he kind of went through and started doing it. Yeah, I like this puzzle. I, it would surprise me. It, it really did. And I would highly recommend you go watch Puzzle Guy's video. It, it uh, for me, it really showed some of the process on, on the solving because Puzzle Guy is just great, 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 great methodology on how to solve puzzles. And so he had a great method and it kind of gave me some ideas um, in watching it. Um, He's very good with packing puzzles too. He, he is, he is. Works. And actually, honestly, I think him and, and uh, some of the other people here at Puzzle Master facil facilitated my love of packing puzzles because I really got into them. Um, specifically, some of the stuff from Pelican. Uh, I really like some of their, their packing puzzles. So.
Mm. Yeah, that is a couplet from Kristen Poliziani and No Way Puzzle. So uh, level eight on the Puzzle Master difficulty rating scale. Uh, definitely go check it out. It has a great little box with it here. And uh, you can see the logo on the front. So I love it. I love some of these new puzzle companies coming out and I feel like uh, No Way Puzzle is probably fairly new in the puzzle game, um, but quite a unique take on just on wooden puzzles um, in general. As well, ID Venture or, or Adventure, check them out. They are great. Ah, uh, they're German. I didn't know that. Hmm. Hmm. Mirbusch, Germany, made in Europe. Go figure. Cool. So that's all our puzzles for today. Definitely go puzzlemaster.ca. Check them out, um, and they're great. Let's move into the online the buzz. Online buzz. Okay, into the videos. Uh, first, I watched. What did I get myself into? Now, let me. Last week, me and Tony got um, stuff sent to us by. What did I get? Oh, get myself shirts. into? Yeah, the shirts. And the cards here right behind you, hey? So uh, you can see there, Tanner and Geneva uh, and their little note for us about the shirts they sent. I'm not wearing my shirt today. We have a blue, and I, I think Tony's was white or something. So uh, yeah, we did get some stuff from them. Tanner's channel, what did I get myself into is phenomenal. Uh, and I watched a video called The Detective Box. Um, it's a little metal box with like a combination code on the front. Mm -hmm. It's from a guy named Joe Guarini. Joe Guarini. I didn't never heard of Joe before. Never heard of this puzzle before, but I watched the video. It was great. Uh, he opens it up. There's some fun stuff inside and it's really unique. He actually goes online to do some of the, uh, the puzzle. Is that the secret opening box one or? Yeah, I guess it's, it's a box. When you open it though, the puzzle's not done. There's, oh. there's much more after that. I'll say that. Watch the video. It's great. Uh, definitely go watch Tanner and Neva and, as they solve puzzles on what did I get myself into. It's a great YouTube channel. One of my favorites and one I think that's going to be growing real fast. Like I, I just, I seriously, it's phenomenal stuff. And he has access to puzzles that are just incredible. So Tanner and Geneva do great stuff. Okay, next. I watched, uh, now this is one you recommended to me. You you sent me, right? Oh yeah. Uh, Metgo, yeah, I, kind of a weird name. Metgo on YouTube. Yeah, uh, yeah it's a guy who does Hanayama yeah, uh, puzzles. Yeah, I was just searching around on YouTube. I think he had popped up on the homepage. Yeah, yeah, it's a great way to find stuff. So Metgo does Hanayama. He does not have a whole bunch of Hanayama. There's only a few. And it was kind of neat because he does them like in front of his keyboard on his computer and just kind of does them with the camera kind of like yeah. shooting over his shoulder. So you just really see his hands. Had some good solutions. I watched uh, himself cast Dial. Uh, have you seen the solution to that one? Uh, yeah, I watched part of that video. Yeah, it was good. It was good. Uh, I would say if you're really into Hanayama, Met goes a little different stuff. Uh, um, maybe off the beaten path a little bit, a little more raw. Ross is by far my favorite. Go Ross, watch, watch Ross uh, DM. Ross, capital DM. Uh, so that's Ross DM on YouTube. He's really easy to follow on solves. That's about yeah. That's if I need a solve, I go to him yeah. usually. He's the Hanayama guy and just incredible explaining stuff. Um, shoots out of the UK and he is phenomenal. So go check out Ross. But also, if you want something a little different, Metgo is also great. So there's some good, good, good uh, YouTubers out there shooting Hanayama stuff these days. Okay, last but not least, now we were talking about this before we were shooting today, Linnea, this is hashtag shorts on YouTube. And this is like YouTube's TikTok, YouTube's TikTok thing, I don't know. Platform. platform. It's, it's, not even, it's, it's inside their platform, so it's not even a separate platform. It's just like, I don't know. Yeah. It's a hashtag shorts. I don't know how to explain it. It's short videos under a minute long, right? Yeah. And we've been throwing some of your, your TikToks on there, right? Yeah, the TikToks. Yeah, so some of our TikTok videos are also going on to YouTube in this hashtag, hashtag shorts. Uh, I was watching Chris Ramsey's videos. Now, him and Puzzle Guy, and I believe probably Mr. Puzzle too, some of the big yeah. puzzle guys are getting into this hashtag shorts thing. I actually really like it. Um, have you watched many of them? Yeah, I watched some of Chris Ramsey's and yeah, I watched, Puzzle Guy's too. I watched Chris's. Um, puzzle Guy was the first one we saw, like he had one, um, it was the IQ puzzle. I think we talked about it last week on our online buzz. I watched Chris's though, and it's called uh, 
this puzzle is insane. Now it was the um, NKD. Oh no, what's I'm gonna forget? Oh, the Mechanigma. Mechanigma. Yes, that's what it was. And he breezes through. Now, if you haven't seen, he breezes through the solution to Mechanigma. Mechanigma is a huge cube with lots of like crazy stuff on it. No, it's it's one that's flat packed and you build it yourself, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's a puzzle within a puzzle. Yeah. And so he shows you the solution and it's like seven steps and he just goes boom, 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 all right in a row. It was really cool. Uh, I think you could even watch it and not fully give away the solution. Like you'd watch it and be like, oh, that's interesting. But I really liked it. Check out Hashtag Shorts on YouTube and uh, we also are doing them on our channel. So definitely look there. Uh, that's all I got though for, uh, for the online buzz today. Um, yeah, I think that's all we got for our episode. So again, um, who was our winner? Do you remember the name? Dave S. Dave S, you have won yourself a Puzzle Master shirt and the Canon puzzle. Send us your size of shirt, Dave, that you want, and we will send that along with your address and we'll uh, get that stuff off to you. No new draw today. We're gonna hold off on that for a little bit. Um, yeah, so that's all we got today. Episode 86 of Puzzle Time. Thank you guys for watching. You can go to, Lena, do you remember all this? I always yeah. get 20 to do this. Where, where, where can they go? So follow us on TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook. I think that's all. Go to our website. website yeah, too, website. Yeah. You, can, you can subscribe to our newsletter there. We do an email newsletter. It is a great place to see some of the new stuff coming out. Yeah. And uh, yeah, that's it. What's all the words? I always forget the words. It's like subscribe is YouTube. Like, subscribe. Like, subscribe get notified yeah whatever it is too. click the bell for notifications yeah. thank follow, you guys like yeah follow there we go yeah, yeah yeah so thank you guys for watching uh we appreciate your viewership and we will have some more puzzles for you in the future and linnea welcome to puzzle time thank you see ya